they don't go nowhere. <laughs> I walked off and there was something following me walking. And guys, I don't know why my camera's going all blurry. I'm trying to get it right. <laughs> why is there always problems with my camera when I get here? Cool. Always, guys. Always look how blurry it's gone. Yeah, cool. Yo, Chris! Chris! Guys, I don't know where Chris is. <laughs> Yo, what's good guys? We are in um, nighttime visit. Me and Chris. Yo guys. We're heading to the Kyle Ashton's cave and we're gonna visit Oliver's Point while we're up here as well. So, just wanna show you in front of me where we are. There's the sign. And if you just look guys, look how dark it is up there. We're gonna head up there now. So guys, in previous videos, we always go to Kyle Ashton's cave as me and Brasso and myself have been there before. We are going to go there, but we're going to head to Oliver's Point first. So we're going to head into the woods. Into the woods, Chris. Into the woods. Let's into go. the woods. Let's go, let's go. So guys, we've come into a bit now where we're at two paths. We've got a left or a right. So it's like, um, it's time to choose. Which way do we go? I'd say left for once. left? Should we go left? Shall we? Do it. Call the camera straight. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna go left, guys. We're gonna go left. I'll show you a bit of what we're doing because I haven't been filming. <clears throat> See how sludge it is. Fair we are trying to find Oliver's point. Very dry down in his box here. Which I think Chris might have been right because yeah. look ahead of us. It looks like we might have found Oliver's point, guys. Let's have a look. Have a look. Oh dear, Is this Oliver's point? Um, no. No, it's not. Oh. It's Iron Age Hill Fort. Wow. Wow, yeah. Let's go in here and investigate. Let's go and have a look. <laughs> I think all of his points to the right must have been. Caught this if I'm wrong, but since we filmed last time, guys, thank you very much. We've hit 100 subscribers now. Yeah, we did. And, it last and one. gone past that. <laughs> so we love you all. Thank you. We do appreciate all the subs, guys. I think it was uh, White Lady's Priory that yeah. we saw it there a couple of videos ago. So, guys, we come across a seat. It's in the middle of the forest, look around. This is literally, we're in the middle of the Nescliffe Forest. There's a seat, just here. <laughs> take a pew, mate. Take, take a, a pew. pew, take a pew. I would, but look at all the stuff that's on it. Loads of wood lice on it. Oh, mate. I'm getting a rat phobia for you guys there. Sorry if we um, trigger you. But yeah, look There's at all that. There's loads on there. Yeah, not for me, mate. Do you want to do a bus truck trial? Explore with Shano and Middy. Let's go. Eat one, Shano. Go on, eat one, nah. Chris. Eat them all, lick them all off. <laughs> no, not for me, guys. Not for me. Getting so, me in the jungle anytime soon. <laughs> so go and keep going, guys. We are going to keep going. There's another one just here, by the looks of it. Another seat made out of a tree. Rocks. 
another one with the um, same things on top you look just here oh disgusting what are you saying Chris beautiful place you like I'm it. happy how the night's turned out because we did drive through rain here guys and obviously it subsided when we've got here so happy midi you know <laughs> it's all good beautiful place though well, so far guys I'm not sure where Elvis point is this could be where we're standing because there is like markings and stuff where people have been and this could be the point watch this Slippy. not too sure because like I say I've never been here before I've always come to Karnash's cave so we are going to have a look around while we're here it looks like we can head down here as well yeah we will we'll go down that way if it's not too dangerous as I say about <laughs> even the markings, if it is guys we're going <laughs> as I say about the markings guys as you see just here I don't know if you can actually make them out. Those are little etchings. I see somebody writing there. People just writing stuff into you, like the names and stuff like that. But guys, yeah. There is literally the top of the the actual, I don't know, know what this place is. I don't know if it's like a cave that we're standing on or not, because I know uh, Karnash's cave is a bit further down. Uh, but obviously in the distance over there, they can make that out to us a petrol station. It is actually on it, I need petrol. It's always a good sign, always a good sign. So we're not too far from a petrol station, that's a bonus for me. So guys, we're going to keep going now, we're going to keep walking around and see what we can find. And we'll hopefully be across Karnash's cave, or even Oliver's Point if we're not there already. So we'll see you in a second. Guys, this is where Chris has just told me that we can get down. Yeah, we can get down here, you're in wellies, just be careful. Yeah, the wellies, I'm going to slip. Careful it's rocks, bro. It's rocks, they're not twigs, they're rocks. Rocks. So guys, we are heading down now. As you can see, down a cliff. I'm gonna put my phone on in my pocket. Probably end up breaking my neck in them in, guys. All because of the YouTube channel. All in the name of YouTube. But it's all good guys. I'm gonna be as safe as possible. Oh. <laughs> Down! <laughs> Morty had a blooper, guys, but he didn't got get him. one. We got him. We got him, guys. Right, we now got him. Now it's turned to, turn to twigs. And... Mate, we actually know where we're going. I'll know as soon as we get to a path. It's like I said, I've been here before. <laughs> and again, I said Shane knows he's going to go over with his fucking wallies. Mate, these wallies are. Oh, whoa, not even. I nearly went there. They're not even safe, bro. These wellies aren't. We are literally right by the cave, bro, I think. Stick to the path, bro. Stick to the yeah. path. Someone's had fireworks up here. So, guys, yeah, room. We made it down. Sorry, I can't look at the lights, man. Let me just adjust that. <laughs> But we have, we've made it down guys, we've made it down. And we are nearly at the cave, so we'll hopefully see you in a sec. Come across a rope on a tree guys. But in the background, there is actually a rope swing. With actually a seat on. If you see, I'll just head up to it. You having a go Chris? What do you reckon guys, you think you should have a go? I think you should have a go. Are you going to have a go? Watch, I'm going to go, guys. Chris is going on the rope swing, guys. Let's let's just move the bag out of the way for you. Oh, shit. Right, ready? <laughs> ready. Yeah, they don't go nowhere. <laughs> Enjoying that, are you? It's a big man, isn't it? Big kid at fucking art. Yeah, nice, he loves it, he loves it guys. A little bit of fun for him. Wee! <laughs> he loves it. Getting off won't be as pretty. Yeah. <laughs> he loves it guys. So we have come across the road swing in the literally middle of nowhere. 
So we, mate, we find some crazy things on explores, but well, <laughs> rope swings, that's a first. That's a proper made first. rope swing as well. Isn't it? Not like we used to make as kids. <laughs> That has got to be a first. And it holds my weight, I mean, come on. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bonus. Hey, there's a moth, a oh, little moth there. Uh, coming Where around. Is it? Where is He's it? gone. He's gone, you're all good. Kids will get some ice on that, mate. So, guys, literally a rope swing in the middle of nowhere. What the, the hell? First. What the hell? And just so you know, I don't even know why my egg cam's on because I'm not even recording. <laughs> I've just got it on just in case, you know, I'm going to probably record it anyway. Either way, we're going to head to the cave, like I keep saying, and we are going to head to the cave, we're heading that way. So what do you reckon, Chris? Yeah, I like it. You I'm like it? Go on that. Give me away, otherwise we'll be here all night. <laughs> right then, we're heading now, guys, we're heading to the cave. I think we should go through the woods, Chris, this way. Yeah. Up here. We're going to go up, guys, we're going to go up. See you in a sec. Mushrooms. We've got some shrooms here, guys. Chris! Do you want some shrooms? Nah, mate, you're <laughs> you might see something in the cave. Probably will anyway. <laughs> Crazy. Come across some steps, guys. As we're walking down, literally down here, down this bank. Sorry about the flashing. Um, yeah, we were heading down. <laughs> what are you doing? It's my thumbstick, I'm professional. <laughs> Look at Chris with his stick, guys. Show your stick. My thumb stick, guys. I'm professional now. <laughs> anyway, guys, what I was saying, we were heading down the path here, and as you see behind me, just here, and yeah, we've um, come across some steps, just here, and steps here. Now this is interesting me right now. I want to go check. There's noises down there as well, though. Exactly, that's why I'm going this way. Well, it just means we've got to walk back up if there's nothing there. There will be, because we're heading down to the cave, aren't we? I think the cave might be this way, you know. I think it's We're not lost, because we are literally by the cave. <laughs> I just know, if we keep going down there, by the cave there is a cliff. So we'll probably come to the fence where the cliff is and we'll have to walk all the way back to the cave. But I'm just really interested why the steps in the middle of a forest just here. Just here, just... <laughs> He's broke his stick, guys. <laughs> so, I'm just a bit confused, really. I'm not walking down there now, because we're on voices. That's what doctor said. <laughs> guys, we're going to go down, then we're going to come back. Can't we just check? No, I'm going to check this. I'm so undecided. Do you know what? You wait here. You wait here. I'll check up here. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Almost fell off the steps. See guys, this is what happens. Just can't like make my mind up. So guys, I'm walking through the forest on my own. Chris is on his own as well, guys. Not sure if he's going to get a little video or something while he's on his own. As you see, this is what I'm seeing. Now last time I come to the cave guys, as you know, I'll just uh, give you a talk to you a second. So last time I came to the cave, the um, the camera froze. Sorry, it's a bit slippy. Um, Go watch where I'm going. And yeah, the camera froze. And strange things was happening. But I don't actually know where we are. Yo, Chris! Chris! Guys, I don't know where Chris has gone. <laughs> I've lost Chris. But that path does go on forever, guys, so I'm really going to find Chris. Yo, Chris! Where are you? Oh, I can hear him, guys. I can hear him now. Literally, middle of nowhere, walking through a forest. I'm going to go back to Chris guys because this path goes on forever and I don't want to go too far that way because that is the way out obviously the way back to the front where we've just been so I'm just going to walk back to Chris and then we will go down here and come back up here 
so I don't lose him, guys. So I don't lose him. We'll see you in a sec. There he is. She's light. Yo. <laughs> so we're going to walk across that path. Yeah. A long ass path. Long ass path. Let's do it. Look how filthy it is, guys. Let's do it in the name <laughs> of YouTube, guys. Look filthy. at that. Absolutely filthy. That's what it's all about. That's what it's about, guys. That's what it's about. Getting out and getting filthy. Watch out for the snake. <laughs> you broke it. <coughs> Rabbit holes. Yeah. Oh, foot now. The foxes are too small to get in there. But they're all over, aren't they? All over here. Just sorting the blur out then guys. So we're back at the same path and we're gonna head up it. Try not to fall down this time. <laughs> Almost <laughs> fell last time a few times. <coughs> Need you to smash that like button as well guys because Chris has lost two stones since doing explores. That's a good little bonus for him. It Hits it Chris. Keep on losing it, I have the body of a god <laughs> Just not a buddy. Dad, if you're watching. <laughs> what do you say about the gym bro? <laughs> so guys, same place we were at just. Heading across the cave. We'll start filming once we get closer. See you in a sec. Trying to make sure I don't fall over here, guys. So sorry if I'm not talking. Because it is a bit slippy, especially when you've got wallies on. Because you don't really get a lot of grip with wallies. Not these ones, anyway. Cheap. <laughs> but they keep your feet warm. It's all the matters, so keep your feet dry, should I say. This is over the top of here, guys. The mountain face in the distance. So if you can see it, I'm going to show you in that vision, yeah, guys. The mountain face. Mountain face? No, rock the cliff face. side. Rock the rock face. face. The rock face. That's the word I'm looking for. The cliff side down there, guys. Look. Where are you? I'm down the cliff. No one down there, mate. No one down there, guys. No one down there. We're, We're going to keep heading down to the cave. Just down this way. So we made it to the cave, guys. As I said, the second one we would come, there's somebody that graffitied the actual sign. First one wasn't. We're kind of cave, as you can see, just here. But we just come across the scarf, just sat here. It says, let it go. Frozen scarf, so if anybody's lost the scarf, this is where it is. Chris, it's giving us a sign, we've just got to let it go. Let it go. Let it go, go Chris. Go. <laughs> I will walk away from I'll walk away now. <laughs> Honestly. Well, I was with you. Because I can't deal with it. I've got it ringing in my head now, so you didn't even sing, sing it. it. It's going in my head. No. Sing it. No. I can't. Let it go. <laughs> see what see. Couldn't help myself, could I? It's like, it's like having a direct. I have to sing it with my daughter, bro. My kids will be banned from watching it. <laughs> if I ever have them, the band already. Guys, I don't know why my camera's going all blurry. I'm trying to get it right. <laughs> Why is there always problems with my camera when I get here? Cool. Always guys, always look how blurry it's gone. Come back with, uh, the Give me a sec guys, let me start that again. Right, let's try again guys, there we go. So this time my camera's gone blurry when I was here. I'll just show you that we are actually at the cave. The cave entrance is just up there. I don't think that's much is off, now it is. Let me just zoom in with that for you. There is the cave entrance. So Humphrey Kai Nashton, that used to stay here with his horse Beazel Bud, Last time we were here, we were standing here doing this, we actually, um, camera froze, but this time it's getting dead blurry. And they always say when something paranormal happens, or going to happen, your cameras start malfunctioning. So if there is anything here, anything paranormal, then show us a sign, do something, touch one of us. Say no preferably. <laughs> Why are you scared? <laughs> you can touch me, I give you the permission to touch me, but I do not give you the permission to follow me once I leave. So 
So, so far, guys, there's nothing as of yet. This is just chilling, guys, as you can see. <laughs> Cotching me. Just chilling just here. What do you think, uh, Chris? Oh, oh sorry, Cave. <laughs> so, what do you think, Cave? Oh, I like the place, mate. It's good. You always say you like the place. Guys. It's been a good explore. I mean, it's massive. I want to come back. I do. I definitely want to come back. But yeah, I'm impressed. I've not been here before. Obviously, the channel, we've done it three times. But yeah, I like the place. I'm impressed. I want to climb that, but I need to lose more weight. <laughs> so, guys, on part two, when we were here, nothing really happened. Obviously, the first time we come here and I was on my own, there was actually where my camera froze, and it's never froze since, so I don't get why it froze. I really don't. People were saying, well, I say people, my brother Kevin was saying that um, it was a malfunction with the camera because it's a shit camera or whatever, but it was brand new. It's still brand well, it's technically still brand new. Uh, second time we come, Brass have got you the sneak peek inside the cave. And this is the third time that we call me, it's night time visit. And the camera was getting a bit blurry just. Don't know why. I haven't got a dis like an, an answer for it. It's just obviously I turned it off, turned it back on and it worked. It was fine. And hopefully this isn't blurry because obviously I'm looking at the camera as I say it and I'm talking to you. For once guys, Shano could not explain what's going on. I can explain the blur. I'm thinking it's either going to be condensation onto my lens. Yeah. Because I wiped the lens, I turned it off and so on. Uh, so far I've seen nothing else happen so we will see we're gonna hang around for a bit guys and then we're gonna f go but we're gonna film while we're still here so guys Karen Ashton's cave at night time putting it in night vision so you can see more definitely a nice little explore at night see, see that we're still here nice explore at night isn't it Chris it is. We walked around Oliver's Point as well, and yeah, we have um, stayed here for, I would say now about 20 minutes or so, Yeah. and we've we've literally come across nothing, there's no noises, no nothing, I mean it is still quite early, it is about 9 or so o'clock, uh, oh no it's not, it's quarter past 10, sorry guys, quarter past 10, so we're going to head back now, and hopefully we might come across something on the way back, we might not, if not guys, what I'm going to do is, is end it right here, right outside the cave. So I just want to say thank you to everybody that subscribed, all the real subscribers, all the people who comment all the time, and all the subscribers that have stayed with us since, since day one. Sorry I can't really talk, the light's blinding me right now, but I just want to say a big thank you from the bottom of my heart, and so does Chris as well. We are very grateful guys, thank you very much, constant support, we do appreciate it. Obviously, <coughs> it's what, excuse me, it's what we do it for guys, thank you very much. Obviously now we're in 2020 speaking to you, so enough love. <laughs> and as always guys, make sure you stay safe, stay blessed, have an amazing day, night or day, whatever it is, stay safe in your whole life. Anyway guys, it's peace from me. Peace from me guys. And we'll see you in the near future. Peace. Guys, now I know I say this in mainly most videos, I keep hearing footsteps, but as I just walked off guys and you know me I'm a non-believer I don't believe in all this crap I walked off and there was something following me walking and Chris is well Chris is down here guys behind me literally Chris where are you show yourself on camera so people don't think you're right in front of me there's Chris guys and I <laughs> and I've heard something literally coming from the cave as I've walked off oh mate it must be my footsteps moving the leaves or something it's got to be Got be guys, got be. I don't know, but either way, guys, we are going. We <laughs> we are walking down. away. So just walking down the path now. But guys, just wanted to put that there so you can see. Just said, look at the roof, guys. That's crazy. Some heavy duty stuff, aren't it? Isn't it? Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, Jimmy Savile's back. Yo, guys, we have come across something right now, just over here. Look at this. Look at where we're going. It's a mine. It's, it's a mine, guys. It's a mine. You, you what, bro? Something in there going. And that's what it sounded like. Something sniffy? Yeah. Something sniffing inside, guys. I heard it once and I thought, what the fuck? Then I heard it again and it's getting louder. I've got it all on video, but I'm sure it's all now.